Hey everyone, it's Coach Randy Stabs from Mindset Volleyball Club. Today is Tuesday, April 14th, and we're going to be doing a horse challenge, but using the letters Mindset VBC. So we're going to have 10 separate challenges for you to do at home. If you like to participate, go get a ball, find an area to work with. Um, outside it is a little bit cold today, but if you want to do it inside, you can probably do that for the most part inside. So um, without further ado, let's get started. Our first one, we're going to bump the ball five times for ourselves. And on the last one, we're going to end up trapping the ball on our arm so the ball doesn't drop. All right, so bump the ball five times, and then catch the ball on, on your arms after five times. One, two, three, four, five, and trap. And it has stopped. All right, good. Our next one is going to be using our foot. We are going to kick the ball. Then we're going to bump the ball. Then we're going to set the ball. We're gonna head the ball and then catch. So once again, it's gonna be foot, bump, set, head, catch. Foot, bump, set, head, catch. All right, foot, bump, set, head, catch. Oh man, I should have turned my hat backwards for that one. All right, got that one. Our next one is gonna be bounce, bump, set, swing. Now I'm gonna probably be facing this way so I don't end up hitting the camera. So I'm going to bounce the ball on the ground, bump, set, swing, okay? All right, bounce, bump, set, swing. All right, came right back. So that was our third one. Our fourth one, we're gonna use a one-hand volley. We're gonna work on top spin with this. So you're gonna get underneath the ball when you get underneath it, it's going to form top spin. And you are, we want to keep it going. We're going to try five times in a row. Okay. So you're going to get under. You're going to follow through with your wrist a little bit. And you're basically getting underneath the ball to form top spin. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Got a little bit off camera for that one. Probably could have done it again, but that's okay. Uh, one hand volley to get underneath it. All right, very nice. Our next one is gonna be setting three in a row without any spin. Now, without any spin, I'm gonna to have to have you be the judge of this as well. So I'm gonna set the ball and we don't want to have any spin on it. So players ask all the time, coach, was that a good set? It's like, well, you can tell yourself based off of how well, without having any spin, you could read the writing on the ball, okay? Looks like we're having a little bit of snow right now. All right, I'm going to set the ball three times in a row. Woo, camera almost came right off. Okay, that was, that was super dangerous. Okay, so three in a row and um, do our best at this, ready? One, that had no spin on it. Two, minimal. Give me one more chance. Oh, I'm gonna get a ladder. That had too much spin on it. You probably saw it on the way back, on the way back down. All right, so I'm gonna get a ladder for that one. Bummer. Okay. Our next one, we are going to bump the ball to our target three times in a row okay so right now i am going to try to bump the ball and i want it to hit this branch right here and make it a small enough target so i want to practice on it now wherever i'm at i can figure out how many feet away so i'm gonna go one two three four five six Seven. I'm going to be seven feet away. I'm going to do my best to get, I'm going to bump the ball to the target three times in a row. All right. Ready? All right. We got one. The ball that got away, huh? All right. About seven feet away. Two, one more, three. 
All right. First one was maybe not my best one. It definitely hit it. It just went a little bit further than we wanted. All right. Our next one, I'm going to be setting the ball at that same target. So I am aiming at this branch right now and doing my best to hit that same spot. I'm going to try to go to 10 feet away. So once again, you can go to it, put one foot over the other. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Setting should be a little bit easier for you. Get right foot in front of your left. You're going to lift the ball to yourself and push. We got one. Two. Three. All right. So luckily those came back to me as well. It's a nice feeling, so I don't have to go run all over the place for it. All right. Our next one, we're going to set the ball to ourself. We're going to set the ball to ourself. We're going to clap 10 times and, and then catch the ball. So you set and you clap 10 times before you catch the ball. So you really have to set the ball high. <laughs> you have to clap quickly and get under it and catch it. So these are like set claps. Sometimes we do bump claps where we Bump the ball, clap, and catch. Sometimes we do two bumps. This one with the set, you're going to really use our legs to get some height on it. And you should have enough time to clap 10 times. Be really quick. So I'll count that out as I go. I'm going to try to set without hitting my tree at the same time. All right, ready. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, eight. Oh, no. It was too many. It was too many. Oh man, I wish I had another try for that. That's okay. All right. Our next one. We are going to punch the ball five times in a row. So when we punch the ball, there's a couple of different ways you can do it. You could do it um, right off of like a bear claw or sand volleyball, right off your knuckles, or I'm gonna go on the higher knuckles and get right underneath it to form some type of backspin to myself. So it's knuckles, so it's not gonna be as accurate. If you did the bear claw, that's fine too. That's five right there with the bear claw. Oh, I don't know if you saw me on that. But I'm gonna go with a straight up punch with instead of the bear claw. All right, ready? One, two, three, four, five. Good. You get to know your volleyball. You get to know how the volleyball bounces and you see what kind of seams you hit it off of and how hard you hit it just by just practicing with it. All right, our next and last one, um, we're gonna bump on one knee 15 times. Okay, so I'm gonna go to one knee and I'm gonna bump the ball consecutively 15 times in a row without going anywhere else. I'm not gonna be moving somewhere. Can't really get off of my knee. So I'm going to do my best to get my arms all the way out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Woo! Just enough. Just enough for that 15. All right. Hope you had a good time playing or at least watching today. Thanks for playing. We will see you tomorrow at 3.30.